<clears throat> All right, let's do a little YouTube garden update. Uh, the old trailer tomato garden with four tomatoes in it is looking great. Look how big these things are. Things are doing awesome in this old dirt. We did put some fertilizer in there too. The rest of that garden is, eh, it's got some strawberries we moved. Uh, looks like some animals got them. We're just trying to keep this from getting too crazy. We'll see what we do. Root barrier still there. All right, got the wheat field right here. It's looking good. It's almost ready to harvest. Kidding. I let the grass grow because there was patchy spots in there. So I want the grass to go to seed there so it can reseed itself. Uh, raspberries back there. Look at these pretty roses. So nice. Got a pink one over there. Look at this. Keeping people from using the weed eater on this. Look at this. This is crazy. This is wild, too. Just let it grow. Kept people from cutting it. That is amazing. Got more coming up over there. Love it. Got a ton over there. I'm going to pull some weeds off of those. I don't want those vines tearing them up. I'm going to let this come in too. Anything else I don't want to come up, runners, then I'll just mow them. You know? Got one here, you can kind of see it. That's a hateful vine. Um, but look, there's the gem in the rough right there. Crazy amount of fruit coming off these plants. Just let them grow. And you'll have food for free off of some bird poop. Let's take a look at these buckets. I'll upload this tonight so the date will be correct for and in sync with my other videos when I started. I can't even get this whole tomato plant in the frame for the bucket. It's already twice the height of the bucket. These planters didn't aren't doing I had to water them. I didn't have to water the buckets though. Had to water these tomatoes they're doing okay though they're doing pretty good they have fruit coming I think look at this look at that little pepper plant these were the same peppers that I have some in buckets that you're gonna see just for context comparison contrast pineapples coming back put it outside didn't like the Sun got shocked but look, it's starting to come back green. It's a little sunstroke, that's all. I pulled some weeds, cut the grass. I guess these flowers are edible. I'm still scared to try it though. Look at this. Even taller than the red bucket. Three foot high out of the bucket. Two and a half feet high. Look at those peppers. Plant the same tray that are over there in the ground. This one's a bucket high. These two, they stayed a little smaller, but they're more robust. That one stayed about the same size and doesn't have any fruit. So he might have been a little, a little deprived. We'll see. I mean, we're talking about June 12th. And look, June 12th in Ohio, that pepper can be picked. Probably might pick it. We'll see. 
What are those? Those are beautiful. That's what those are. This one is a little scrawnier, but it's got more fruit. Well, not more than this, baby. <laughs> it's coming in. Exciting. Bucket growing. So easy to do. Don't know where my head was at or what I was thinking. Not paying attention when I see all these people doing it. Great idea. Fast food. That's what you call fast food. All right. Thanks for to clean out those compost bins. Compost rollers over there. I keep moving it around and rolling it. But uh, it had all these paw prints on it. These raccoons trying to push it or get it open or something. Kind of funny. I should probably set a camera up on it. All right, guys. Thanks. Peach tree. Don't know if we'll get peaches. Bloodhounds. Those are bloodhounds in the back. They want in. Cleaned up all their bushes over there. The, um, the wheat field is doing great. I'll leave you with that.